night developments on breaking news we first told you about last night at 10. Investigators are still working to determine what caused a boating accident that killed two people on Grand Lake. This morning, we're learning more about the two young victims. Two News reporter Patricia Santos is live near Duck Creek on Grand Lake, which is south of Bernice, with the new information. Patty? Well, a total of eight people were involved in this crash, and overnight we have learned that those killed are identified as Rachel Swetnam and Trey Varner, both of them in their 20s. And that actually happened right here at the Arrowhead Yacht Club. It happened in that direction of the lake that you see right behind us, and you would actually have to take a boat in order to be able to see it. But take a look. This is a picture that one of our viewers sent to us just minutes after this accident happened. This is a picture courtesy of Rick Chisholm. You can see that the small boat, um, inside the houseboat, which was docked at the time of this incident. Now, GRDA investigators say Swetnam and Barner were riding on the front of the boat and were thrown off when it careened into the houseboat. Two passengers were taken to Vanita Hospital. Four others on the boat were not injured. Now, all of this happened around 5.30 yesterday near Duck Creek on Grand Lake. Investigators have, um, have not said what may have led to this crash. And we found a Facebook page for Rachel Swetnam, uh, which indicates that she she attended Cashel Hall Preparatory School in Tulsa, and several Twitter messages have been posted uh, uh, for her as well as Barner. Um, now, investigators will be back here at 8 o'clock this morning to continue their investigation. Live at Grand Lake, Patricia Santos, 2 News works for you. All right, thank you.